Dollar Sign, Wikipedia article audio. The dollar sign is a symbol primarily used to indicate the various units of currency around the world. The symbol can interchangeably have one or two vertical strokes. In common usage, the sign appears to the left of the amount specified, as in one dollar. Origin Pillars of Hercules A common hypothesis holds that the sign derives from the symbolic representation of the Pillars of Hercules A Euro This representation can either have a banner separately around each pillar, or as in the Spanish coat of arms, a banner curling between them. In 1492, Ferdinand II of Aragon adopted the symbol of the Pillars of Hercules and added the Latin warning non plus ultra meaning nothing further beyond, indicating this is the end of the world. But when Christopher Columbus came to America, the legend was changed to plus ultra, meaning further beyond. The Pillars of Hercules wrapped in a banner thus became a symbol of the New World. The link between this symbol and the dollar sign is more clearly seen in Spanish coins of the period, which show two pillars, each with a separate banner, rather than one banner spanning both pillars. In this example the right-hand pillar clearly resembles the dollar sign, and additionally directly relates to the use of money. The symbol was adopted by Charles V and was part of his coat of arms representing Spain's American possessions. The symbol was later stamped on coins minted in gold and silver. The coin, also known as Spanish dollar, was the first global currency used in the entire world since the Spanish Empire was the first global empire. These coins, depicting the pillars over two hemispheres and a small S-shaped ribbon around each, were spread throughout America, Europe, and Asia. According to this, traders wrote signs that, instead of saying Spanish dollar, had this symbol made by hand, and this in turn evolved into a simple S with two vertical bars. When the U.S. gained their independence from Great Britain, they created the American dollar, but in its early decades they continued to use the Spanish dollar, which was more trusted in all markets. The United States, even after independence, was still using the pound sterling as currency. This is attested in state legislation of the early 1780s, referring to pounds and pence, which predated the U.S. Constitution and federal legislation. Given the origin of this theory a euro related to Spanish colonization of the Americas a euro it is likely that the cifra pound o or peso signs share the same origin, and that the double stroke usage is merely a stylistic variant, rather than a distinct character. Alternative Origin Hypotheses The sign is first attested in Spanish American, American, Canadian, Mexican and other British business correspondents in the 1770s, referring to the Spanish-American peso, also known as Spanish dollar or piece of eight in North America, which provided the model for the currency that the United States adopted in 1792 and the larger coins of the new Spanish-American republics such as the Mexican peso, Peruvian eight real and Bolivian eight soul coins. This explanation holds that the sign evolved out of the Spanish and Spanish-American scribal abbreviation PE sent for pesos. A study of late 18th and early 19th century manuscripts shows that the S gradually came to be written over the P, developing into a close equivalent to the dollar mark. A variation, though less plausible, of this hypothesis derives the sign from a combination of the Greek character psi and s. Other Hypotheses There are a number of other hypotheses about the origin of the symbol, some with a measure of academic acceptance, others the symbolic equivalent of false etymologies. Among the various hypotheses, 
the simplest one is that the Bard S is actually a typo modified 8, from its obvious link with the pieces of 8, the popular name of the Spanish dollar. The added bar should be the same commonly used to distinguish a letter dedicated to a currency value, like a pound. Kingdom of Sicily denarii minted by Manfred of Hohenstaufen in the Kingdom of Sicily between 1258 and 1266 had what can be construed as an early dollar symbol. These coins were widely circulated outside Europe due to the Crusades, including the crusade that targeted Tunis. Drawn with two vertical lines Several alternative hypotheses relate specifically to the dollar sign drawn with two vertical lines. From U.S. A dollar sign with two vertical lines could have started off as a monogram of USA, used on money bags issued by the United States Mint. The letters U and S superimposed resemble the historical double-stroke dollar sign, the bottom of the U disappears into the bottom curve of the S, leaving two vertical lines. It is postulated from the papers of Dr. James Alton James, a professor of history at Northwestern University from 1897 to 1935 that the symbol with two strokes was an adapted design of the Patriot Robert Morris in 1778. Robert Morris was such a zealous Patriot a Euro known as the financier of the revolution in the West a Euro that conjecture does not overstep its bounds in purporting this hypothesis as viable. A similar idea claims that the letters U and S would stand for unit of silver, referencing pieces of eight again but that is unlikely since one would expect it to be in Spanish instead. German Thaler Another hypothesis is that it derives from the symbol used on a German Thaler. According to Ovasen, on one type of Thaler one side showed a crucifix while the other showed a serpent hanging from a cross, the letters knew near the serpent's head, and on the other side of the cross the number 21. This refers to the Bible, Numbers, Chapter 21. A similar symbol, constructed by superposition of S and I or J, was used to denote German Joachim's Thaler. It was known in the English-speaking world by the 17th century, appearing in 1686 edition of an introduction to merchants' accounts by John Collins. Later History Robert Morris was the first to use that symbol in official documents and in official communications with Oliver Pollock. The U.S. dollar was directly based on the Spanish milled dollar when, in the Coinage Act of 1792, the first Mint Act, its value was fixed as being of the value of a Spanish milled dollar as the same as now current and to contain 371 grains and 4 sixteenth parts of a grain of pure, or 416 grains of standard silver. According to a plaque in St. Andrews, Scotland, the dollar sign was first cast into type at a foundry in Philadelphia, United States in 1797 by the Scottish immigrants John Bain, Archibald Binney, and James Ronaldson. The dollar sign did not appear on U.S. coinage until February 2007, when it was used on the reverse of a $1 coin authorized by the Presidential $1 Coin Act of 2005. The dollar sign appears as early as 1847 on the $100 Mexican war notes and the reverse of the 1869 $1000 United States note. The dollar sign also appears on the reverse of the 1934 $100,000 note. In Japanese and Korean, the Han character A 1 4th has been repurposed to represent the dollar sign due to its visual similarity. Use in computer software 
The dollar sign is one of the few symbols that are almost universally present in computer character sets but rarely needed in its literal meaning within computer software. As a result, the character has been used on computers for many purposes unrelated to money. Its uses in programming languages have often influenced or provoked its uses in operating systems, and applications. Encoding The dollar sign dollar has Unicode code point U plus 0024. U plus 0024 dollar dollar sign. There are no separate characters for one and two line variants. This is typeface dependent. There are also three other code points that originate from other East Asian standards, the Taiwanese small form variant, the CJK full width form, and the Japanese emoji. The glyphs for these code points are typically larger or smaller than the primary code point, but the difference is mostly aesthetic or typographic, and the meanings of the symbols are the same. UNFE 69I superscript 1 copyright small dollar sign, U plus FF 04I 1 fourth full width dollar sign, U plus 1F4B 2 superscript 2 heavy dollar sign. However, for usage as the special character in various computing applications, U plus 0024 is typically the only code that is recognized. Programming Languages Operating Systems Applications Currencies that use the dollar or peso sign In addition to those countries of the world that use dollars or pesos, a number of other countries use the dollar symbol to denote their currencies, including Nicaraguan CA superscript 3 Erdaba, Samoan Tala Tongan Payonga. An exception is the Philippine peso, whose sign is written as A plus or minus. The dollar sign is also still sometimes used to represent the Malaysian ringgit, though its official use to represent the currency has been discontinued since 1993. Some currencies use the cifra poundo, similar to the dollar sign, but always with two strokes. Brazilian Real, Cape Verde Escudo, Portuguese Escudo. In Mexico and other peso using countries, the cifra poundo is used as a dollar sign when a document uses both pesos and dollars at the same time, to avoid confusion, but when the dollar sign is used alone, it is usually represented as US dollar or by its ISO 4217 code USD. Example, US $5 or 5 US dollars. However, in Argentina, the dollar sign is always used for pesos, and if they want to indicate dollars, they always write U dollar S5 or 5 US dollars. In the United States, Mexico, Australia, Argentina, New Zealand, Hong Kong, Pacific Island nations, and English-speaking Canada, the dollar or peso symbol precedes the number. Five dollars or pesos is written and printed as five dollars, whereas five cents is written as five a cent. In French-speaking Canada, the dollar symbol usually appears after the number, although it sometimes appears in front of it. Other Uses the dollar sign is also used in library cataloging to represent subsections. Also, it is used derisively to indicate greed or excess money such as in micro dollar oft, George Luca dollar, Lar dollar Ulrich, De dollar Ni, Chell dollar EA and GW dollar, or supposed overt Americanization as in dollar KY. The dollar sign is also used intentionally to stylize names such as A$AP dollar A P Rocky, Kesha and Thai dollar dollar IGN or words such as A Yen A dollar. In 1872, 
Ambrose Bierce referred to the California governor as Dollar Tealand Land Ford. In Scrabble notation, a dollar sign is placed after a word to indicate that it is valid according to the North American word lists, but not according to the British word lists. Notes